Tennessee and Oregon State, and we are off and running here in Indianapolis. They're being picked to finish last in the preseason conference poll, just a remarkable turnaround to their season over the last few weeks. And, and they wear that type of, they wear that disrespect on their sleeve. And you, first touch for Jaden Springer. Highly touted freshman, here he oh. comes to the bucket. Pretty oh. finish to get Tennessee its first points. I think they have a really good chance to win this basketball game, especially if they don't turn it over. Thompson finding Lucas from deep. Thompson puts it on the deck. Offensive rebound, Silva there to clean up the mess. Um, but at the same time, they don't really block shots well. So attack that basket and see if you can get in there. James, tough fade, puts it down on the baseline. Uh, nice bucket by the yoga master. Throughout and committed to changing his body. Something we'll get into a little bit more as the day goes on. Nice little turnaround shot and the answer from Ethan Thompson. State has numbers. If they run it, if they run it, they push it. They, they didn't run hard enough right there, but they're still going to get a good shot. But when you have numbers and you can take advantage of Tennessee not being set defensively. But Tennessee, if you've just joined us, has missed seven of their first nine shots. Vescovi underneath finds some daylight. Ooh. Masterfully done. Oh, ho, ho. nice reverse. Put a little bit of... Put a little bit of English on that thing, Spiro. I like when you break it down. I mean, I try. I try, I try to do a little something, Spiro, you know. Maurice Kalou, who was so good Hello. in the Pac-12. Hello. And there's that three-point shooting. Lucas. Good point. This is not a team equipped to come back from big deficits. Right now in a nine-point hole. Still early. Thompson, quite resourceful, follows his own miss. Resilient. That's what we call it. Thompson with three to shoot. Talks turn around. Well played defensively. And James to lose change. Ahead of the field to Springer. Boy. Beautifully done. Boy, did Tennessee need that one. They needed something to just get their confidence going. Pons picked up a second personal at the 12.08 mark of the half. Johnson off balance, nearly throw it away. Plopchich gets it out to Springer. Finds his spot in a friendly bounce for the freshman. Springer is Rick Barnes' leading scorer. All SEC freshman player. Reichel from deep. Hello. Got it. A 2-15 matchup in what would be a ooh, massive ooh, upset. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What a defensive play by Alatiche. Start. And you want interior defense, Warif Alatiche giving the volunteers, Brendan, a taste of their own medicine. I like Alatiche right there with the nice block. Oh, and Alatiche with the look back as well. Got to let him know, not in my house, Matumbo style. No, 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 no. My goodness. And Lucas. Doing it off the bounce. Oregon State's getting good quality shots, whether it's off pin downs or bar rotations. Tennessee's getting one-on-one -on -one fadeaway leaners and floaters. That's not going to cut it. Silva. They're confident now. Tennessee needs a timeout. play. Timeout taken by Rick Barnes. You don't want that type of trouble. Trust me. I was the number three for Carolina one year, and we lost to Weaver State. I still have memories. I still have memories and nightmares about that game in Harold, the show Arsenal. Santiago Vescovi. There we go. Finally. Got a three-point shot to drop. Key piece for this Oregon State program, four years. He got to the dance, part of that 2016 team. Silva oh. again with that footwork. Oh, I see you, Silva. Tennessee till this point, just 14 points. Six of 27 shooting, a 22% clip. Silva, Listen. he has scored eight straight for the Beavers. Bill Roberts has pulled the upset. Oh my goodness, are you serious? And Brenton's bracket do you has hear, just do you, been blown do you up. Hear this, do you hear that sound? That's the sound of my bracket being thrown <laughs> in the trash can. Thank you, thank you, uh, OSU. Thank you, Ohio State. 2016, that Middle Tennessee State victory over Michigan State, and only the ninth time ever. Victor Bailey. And a badly needed three for the Volunteers. Thompson gets the screen. Hold Underneath, up. Silva was open. Quickly defense. closed by Johnson. Two seconds. Johnson taking play, puts it down. Incredible. Look at this play. Johnson going coast to coast right here after the excellent steal. Takes off. This young man is so athletic. And then he puts the jelly on the roll right there at the end, Spiro, and uses the glass. Keon Johnson, their second leading scorer. A freshman who has been sensational this season for Rick Barnes in Tennessee. Then we touched on in the opening half. Have to find a spark here over the final 20 minutes. Reichel spots up in the corner. That's a three. Oh. Got it. I'd go right into Pond. I mean, I'd go right into Silva. Pond is on him. Pond's playing with three. Silva. Popped it up. Gets it back and goes glass. Man, what a game this young man is having. Silva, 7-1, 265 pounds. And he's got a lot of skill in those legs. 
James from deep. Can't buy one. Johnson. Right back into him. Go right back into the big fella. Play inside out. Reichel thought about it for Scovey bit. Reichel setting the table. Alatiche outside Lucas. Wow. That's a three. Last foul charge to Reichel. And then Springer pulled the string on it. Springer, the leading scorer, no six way. points. Don't do that. Okay, Reichel. Three. Hold up now. Wait a minute. Just keep on coming. Whoa. Reichel from Corvallis that time. And it's all Beavers. Zach Reichel with a three-point jack. And it's a 19-point game. Tennessee quickly cuts into the deficit. Johnson expressing himself. At the same time, Oregon State's been able to play with a comfortable lead, so. Oh, boy, when Lucas. You're, when, when you're an underdog and you're playing with a comfortable lead, there's Ethan. We Thompson knew. dialing it up from deep. We knew he was going to get going, and, and the younger guys on the team, but now everybody's on the same page. They don't ha uh, they don't allow excuses anymore. They just go out there and get things done, and they're getting it done tonight, even though that's a good shot right there by Baylor. Which of these two teams will advance? And a chance at three for the freshman Johnson. You see how j just the, the full court pressure to the trap, it sped Oregon State up. Tennessee's going to have to create more possessions. Johnson couldn't hit. James is there. Oregon State wanted an offensive interference. That was a foul, but the referees say play on. Hunter the open floor into the corner. Kalu. Hello. Knocks down to three. No fear, no fear in Oregon State. 15 point game as we come up on the midway point of the second half. Thompson, high post, leads in some contact and gets it to go. Once again, that lid is on the three. That lid is on the basket for Tennessee from three. Bailey misses on a three and no time at the other end. It's Kalu for the Beavers. Bailey misses again. They're two of 18. Offensive rebound, Johnson. They'll reset. Viscovi pulls the trigger. Out Got time. It. Have to go all the way back to March of 1982. 39 years ago no, yesterday. Why not? Silva. Why not? New career. <laughs> why high. not? Silva at a Rancho Cucamonga, California. Playing the best game of his life on the biggest stage. Springer. Able to slither down the paint. Hoping he's got some magic left for his Tennessee mates. Johnson, Johnson speaking down behind the play. As he trails the play. Lucas from the corner. Splash. And Tennessee is down night, make it 20. Beautiful looking bank by Bailey. Hunt on a long three, rebound by Springer. Gotta have it. Vescovi from deep. Gotta have it, okay. This is Springer, their freshman and leading scorer. Underneath, dangerous pass, Pons the save to Vescovi. Johnson, got Hello. it! Got it. Hey, and got here it. comes Tennessee. How Oregon State handles this pressure and hits their free throws will determine what the outcome of this ball game is going to be. Thompson underneath. Alatiche, beautifully done. Ball moved around the perimeter. Alatiche finishes it off inside right over Ponds. Nicely oh. done. Springer back door to Johnson as he grimaces in pain. Hunt in the open floor. Beavers in no hurry. Thompson's going to shoot and hits. And the biggest surprise is just the ease with which Oregon State has played in this game. Tennessee has never led. Put back play by Bailey and then Rick Barnes with a quick timeout. Down to 90 seconds. Springer. Big put back. 10 point game. Timeout with 128 left. And the Oregon State Beavers are headed to the round of 32. Their first win in the big dance in 39 years.